it through Google Play, since you know Google Play now has official beta testing program. So you can test it yourself, um, but it's interesting because we believe it's from the makers of blind type. Now you have to go way back beyond a year or two to, to recall blind type, which was a keyboard that allowed you to sort of blindly type on your keyboard and it would figure out what you were trying to type. Now Google bought them and so that app actually never came to life. We never actually saw it, but we believe you know Google used it to build in technology into their stock Android keyboard. So anyways, the guys are back or some of them or one of them. Anyway, somebody related to blind type is back with this keyboard called Flexi that also allows you to sort of blindly type around but outside of that they threw in these sort of swipe gestures where you can add spaces or punctuation or switch between words um, without actually having to touch like the space bar or period or um, you know delete or something like that so you can type and swipe around it's actually kind of a cool concept now it'll take some getting used to I'm not gonna lie but I thought I'd show it to you anyway just so you guys can get maybe sort of a feel for this and then I highly recommend you go beta test this yourself so we we'll get a little closer here. Now, if I wanted to start typing like the word this, so you can see I actually misspelled it and typed vid. If I swipe to the right, it does a space um, so that I can start typing my next word, but it also recognizes that I misspelled this and it's recommending this for me as an option. Now, you can also see there's other things in here like thud, thus, whose, thug, eggs. So if I wanna to get to those other words, I can actually swipe down and it will start taking me through. It kinda of like scrolls through them. So let's say I decide, I want eggs. All right, so I'll say eggs are yummy. And I wanted yummy there and I sort of mistyped it on purpose. So I'll swipe over and it actually corrected that to yummy for me. Now, if, if I didn't want yummy, I could go ahead and swipe down to funny or I'll say, actually I did kind of want yummy. I can swipe back up and get to yummy. And then if I want to put a period in there, it's just another swipe to the right because it knows that I've essentially typed an entire sentence. So I can keep going like, um, I could say smart phones are our life. And we'll see, and it actually typed life. So I'm gonna hit a swipe again to the right and it actually knows that I typed a sentence so we ended up getting a period there. But I could just type this and do a double swipe and it actually gives me another period. Um, you can also go back and delete by swiping to the left. So you can see I'm just swiping to the left and it's deleting all of this stuff. Um, you should also be able to, like if I type this and I get a period, you should be able to, well, let me go back there. Thought you could then swipe between punctuation, but, oh, there we go. It actually backspaced there.